ZZ here, and you are watching Georgia TV Now, the absolute best of South Georgia. And Dana, we're finally we're here. here. I am so excited. Absolutely. We are at the Okie Finoki Swamp Park today in, in Waycross. Waycross, Georgia. And we're hosting the show from here today. We are, and we're going to be bringing you the absolute best of South Georgia, just like we promised. Mm -hmm. And we're going to be taking you to Alma, Douglas, Baxley, Blackshear, Blackshear Waycross, and don't and forget all Jessup. Over. Absolutely. So stay tuned and keep watching. Don't leave us, honey, because we're uh -huh. going to take you on the ride of your life. Let's go, Dana. Come on, let's go. All right. Okay, Blakey, here we go. and you're watching Georgia TV Now and we're bringing you the very best of South Georgia. And we're here at the Okie Pinocchio Swamp and I'm here with Old Roy. And did you know that Old Roy was 90 years old when he passed away in 1972? He was over 12 feet long and over 70 inches around his belly. And you know, I bet you didn't know this. I am an alligator whisperer. And I'm gonna try it out with Old Roy here. Yeah. Oh, Roy, oh my gosh, it's the Nobia shoe, Roy. he's eating Zenobia, hold on, we're off to Alma, Zenobia, you just hang in, hang in there Zenobia, we're off to Alma, stay with us, Roy. Dana and Zizi here, and you're watching Georgia TV Now, the absolute best of South Georgia, and we are in the Okefenokee Swamp, honey, and this is the most extraordinary tour. We're having a great time. Absolutely. Um, like Zenobia said, we're on a boat. We're on their boat tour here at the Swamp. They've got all kinds of tours available for you, but it is so exciting to be up close to all the natural wildlife Absolutely. in their own habitats. It's a we lot of fun. We just saw a blue heron. He was so handsome. We've seen turtles. We've seen alligators. This is an environmental park. Paradise. It's a lot of fun, and we can't Absolutely. wait to share more of it with you, so stay with us. But right now, we're going to head to Baxley. Keep watching. ZZ here with Georgia TV Now, the very best of South Georgia, and we are here with Mr. L. Dean out in the Okefenokee Swamp. And you've been working out here a long time, Mr. L. Dean. 29 years. Oh, and my eight goodness. Months full time. Well, we've only been out here a short time, and we have so seen some of the most beautiful nature and, and, and animals that I've it seen is. in a long time. Tell everybody what they can see when they come and visit you all out here. In the springtime, there's lots of flowers start to bloom. Uh huh. You'll see more flowers, like the water lilies, wow. bonnet lilies, uh huh. pink flowers. You'll see purple flowers, uh -huh. like pickle weed, and then that's when you'll see more birds activity too. Because a lot of migratory birds come through here. Oh, I got you. So we've seen a heron already today. Now, what other kind of birds? I know eagles like are there. Uh huh. Sandhill cranes. Right. And there will be also a little warbler. Oh. Called a prothonotary warbler that will come out here. Right. He will be here in about April. Okay. And well, they nest. They come up from South America. And, and nest. nest here. Wow. And then when it starts getting cold, they go back down south. I got you. Well, put it on your calendar, everybody. Come and visit the Okefenokee. In Swamp. the springtime, it's prettiest. Oh, yeah, like it's beautiful. Late April, in the spring. early May. Mm -hmm. That's the prettiest time of year. Well, yeah, tell everybody to come on out. We will. Come on out and see us. All right, and keep watching. Hey, you're watching Georgia TV Now, and we're here at the Okefenokee Swamp Park, and we're here with Sharon and Zenobia, and we're here with Nut. Yes. Sharon, what do you do here at this uh, park? Oh, uh, I take care of the animals and do the nature shows and, and things like that. Well, tell me about Nut. How old is Nut, and how long have y'all had him uh, here? Nut is around five, and we, uh, the DNR actually brought Nut to us because he was found in somebody's house. In yeah. somebody's oh, house. <laughs> oh my gosh, can you imagine? Walk in and go in to get your cereal that morning and a blackberry in your house. 
house. But it was actually raised by somebody. I think that's what happened. Is they found him with a cub and raised him. And he grew. <laughs> oh, I think he's made a friend in Zenobia. <laughs> <laughs> it's like somebody better give me some food. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh my yes. goodness. Yes. Okay. Put it through the fence. Is it flat handed? Uh, he's not going to grab your, your uh, fingers. He's not interested okay. in your fingers. Oh, They're good. actually more vegetarian than they are meat eaters. Oh, oh well, that's really? good. That yeah, is I very comforting. Oh, my goodness. Let me see if he'll come up here for us. Well, well now, no, how, how much big is, will he get? This is as big as he'll get. He's actually oh. kind of fat because he, he, he doesn't have as much activity as a wild bear would have. I see. Oh my goodness, he's got some serious teeth there. Yes, uh -huh. and claws. Oh my goodness. <laughs> All right, Nut, since you're you know, standing up so nice and tall now, they told us that you have the best directions to Blackshear. <laughs> you need, and that's where we need to go because that's where we're taking everybody on this adventure. So you need to let us know where we go. All right, now you say you take a left when you get out the park and then you take a right <laughs> window. Yeah. <laughs> You're so cute. <laughs> yeah. Keep watching, we're going to black. <laughs>